Welcome to this lecture. In this lecture, we are going to learn about validation checks. Open dev form. Go to toolbox and here search validation provider. Double click here. And validation provider is added into your form so you can customize rules select control like this one is text ID and here you can select rules that is less or between or greater or you can assign it that error type information warning critical so warning or you can select case sensitivity and here you can select that not empty like that is not blank okay and go to solution explorer open program dot cs and change the first form or main form new extra form to dev form run the program And if you select student ID and skip this field or go to dev form select this one and now select manual save it run this program again Check this one. Select it auto. Click here. And now look at here. This value is not valid. Because we are not provided any value in this text box. So you provide any value and now you can leave this field. Otherwise you cannot leave this field even because empty text box is not allowed in case of student ID. So if you want to leave first fill any value and then you can leave this field. Over, you can apply if condition in your code that this field should be valid or is equal to some text and now you can click here customize validation select text name condition error type over condition operator is not blank error type is critical ok and run the program so if you want to skip this field you are bound to write anything in this field and now here is the error message this value is not valid so first write anything and then you can press tab and here is the cursor otherwise the cursor will be here if 
the text box is equal to empty in programming condition so thank you for watching this video